What's going on fans? Today I saw I got a few requests about some of my um, Borderlands stuff. So I want to show you my collection I have as of right now. I do have more stuff coming in the mail. But here's a quick tour and I hope you enjoy it. So I'm going to start from left to right. Anyways, most of the stuff, actually pretty much everything, came from my local GameStop. If I couldn't get it there, they would find it for me. And I get a little discounts here and there. Little customers. I love it. But anyways, and I appreciate it guys. If you guys ever see this video, Mr. Heritage Square. But anyways, we'll start from left to right. Anyways, in the back over there, that's Lilith. That's actually a statue. One of a kind. Well, not the only statue itself, but only one in the Borderlands figurines that I could find of any of the characters. So, I hope they make more of these because I really like this statue. It's tall, it's a good filler, and she looks good. So, but that's her from Borderlands 3. Then over here, we got a Psycho. The Psycho is awesome. He does come with an axe, he's pretty poseable. His top move is pretty good. But he's your basic guy, you gotta have a Psycho in your group. Of course, here, you got your Vault Key. It does break into three pieces. But he came with one of my figurines. Then back there, we have Lilith from Borderlands 3. She's a pop. I'm not big into pops, but for this collection, I had to get some fillers like that. It's amazing. I like it. But it's staying in a box. And above it, Claptrap. You gotta have a Claptrap in there somewhere. He's a keychain. I just throw him in there. He was on sale. Looks cool. So, then of course, I like to call my sweetheart, my Borderlands wife, Miss Maya. Well, fortunately everyone knows, spoiler alert, if not, she does get incinerated in Borderlands 3. But, this statue is amazing. I like it. It's actually one of my top favorites. Well, second favorite in the Borderlands. So, So, moving on, we got a Moxie bar set. Yes, those are real glasses. I did talk about this. I do wish it lit up. And it'd be awesome if actually real speakers in it. But it does come with real shot glasses. It comes with a real badass bottle opener. And you can never go wrong with coasters. It comes with four of them. And they're actually rubberish. And they do work. They work amazing. So, then we have Borderlands 3 Maya, which statue, pop figure. So, she's cool. I had to get her. There's supposedly one out there that lights up, so I want to, supposedly it glows or something. This ain't it, but I'm going to look for that one. Then in the back, we have my favorite villain in the world, besides Joker in the DC Universe, is Handsome Jack. He was the first protagonist, antagonist, I apologize, in Borderlands 2. And I liked his story. He was amazing. And uh, that figurine is pretty cool. I like it. He does come with a different face. So you can switch it out. And uh, his weapon isn't the greatest. You have to kind of like wedge it in there or try to fit in there. But... Yeah, we'll do a Rio view on him in another day. Over here, another statue. By the way, these statues, this one and Maya, are actually from Mini Epics, if I'm saying it right. But these statues are amazing. I do have the Psycho and Tiny Tina coming in to complete all four of them. So I should be getting those here in the, hopefully next week. And in the back over there, we got another Maya. This is actually a Borderlands 2 version of her. But she was a special. She randomly showed up and I had to get her. And the messed up part is I went to GameStop three times to order this stuff. And like, oh, it's the different store. It's here. It's here. And I go there now. They have like three of these now. So go figure, right? But then, of course, my favorite elemental, the Firehawk. Got, got one of her. Her figure is awesome. Her weapon fits in there really well. 
she's really poseable minus the part over here on the, the side her leg doesn't really go too far but I like the fact they have the Borderland stands they're labeled and I have a bunch more figures like I said I at least have three more coming in in about a week so I might have to do an after review but I really hope you guys enjoyed this any questions any comments be great thank you